What is going on, folks? Today is Wednesday, March 27th. My name is Joey. Thank you for tuning in. Just call me the Monday Call Radio. Okay. There's a mic phone right there. Let me know if you're hearing me now. Gee whiz. Yeah, Joseph, there's an audio problem. Hold on. Let me clip this on my, my lapel. Okay. You were probably just hearing noise from over here at the, uh, the table while I was way over here at this side of the shop. It's like this is my first time doing it instead of my 900th. <sighs> okay. Okay. Um, Back over to the table. Let's get into this unboxing. Look at me. Look at me here. Yo, what's going on, Sarah? Thank you for tuning in. Uh, okay, you can hear me now. Thank you, Kevin. Okay, first collection opening this one up right here. What's it say up here? Kitchen glasses. Let's hope there's retro games in here instead. First thing right here on the top, it's an NES console. What's going on, Judy? Good to see you. Sarah, I am having a good day so far. It just started raining here in Pennsylvania. I think we're supposed to have a rainy afternoon and a rainy day tomorrow, but hey, it's at least in the 50s. Whoa, check this out. Look, this NES just opened up right here. Doesn't seem to have any screws holding it together. Let's take a look at it. Yo, what's up, Summer? Uh, okay, oh, also... Let me know. Are you, you, you guys are able to hear me now? Okay. Thank you, David. I do giveaways regularly on this channel. Today could be the day. Could be something that comes out of today's collections. All you have to do to be entered in this giveaway for my Facebook viewers is to share the post and comment right down in the chat that you share. It's easy. Takes seconds to do. Gets you entered. You help me out by helping spread the stream around. I help you out by getting entered into a free giveaway. Share the post, comment that you shared. What's going on, Vintage? Appreciate the kind words. I realize that I'm not giving, right now I'm live streaming to two platforms, Facebook and YouTube at the same time. So the screen that I'm looking at here has comments coming down from YouTube and Facebook. Facebook uh, scrolls a little bit slower. It's a little easier to catch. YouTube kind of comes in in chunks. I do my best, YouTube, to see your comments and respond to you guys too. I'm gonna put a little more effort into it today. Bob, you made an order today? That's exciting. What do you go with? All right, let's take a look at this NES console. So, does the lid come off? It sure does. And let's see what's inside here. So, there's a heat shield up top, and it looks like this doesn't have any screws in it either. Can take that off. Digging down a little deeper, this is where the games slide in and then push down. Oh boy. Um, back here, this pin connector is where the games make the connection to the game. Over time, these pin connectors just get worn out. If you were to pick up one of these at a yard sale, it would have an old pin connector in it. Uh, it would have a tough time making a connection to the game. We replace these 72 pin connectors with fresh new ones. So when you slide your NES game in, you're gonna have a much better time getting started up. Um, and then, yeah, there's here's this. So this is the disc tray. That can come out as well. There's not a single screw in this NES. Disc tray. And then down here, circuit board. Here's the pin connector. This slides off the back. It's a little tough to do. Um, look at the size of that capacitor back there. Uh, here's the little light. Okay, you see this little light right here that turns on when you hit the power button? You can see it's this light right there. And then here's this action on these buttons. You can see power button getting pushed in and reset button. 
wires connecting the controller ports. Back up here to the circuit board. Kind of neat getting glimpse inside. Okay, goes back together something like this. Let's keep moving on. Thanks for sharing, Mike. You too, Eric. Sean, what's going on? I love your vids, and your vids have reunited my love for retro games. Sean, I love to hear it. You know, I do this stuff all day long. It's really great to hear somebody reach out and say, you know, it made a difference for me. New Super Mario Bros. on the DS. And Vice City. There it is for PS2. Vice City and uh, San Andreas. I would say two best sellers for us for GTA games. Char Char, that's how you sell your consoles in the best condition. Char Char, were you trying to make a joke here about this NES coming to us without any screws in it? That was pretty funny. Okay, NES, we've got Batman, the video game. Batman symbol right on it. I can't believe they actually would beam the bat signal up into the sky. My cat, Stabby, is watching, Mithy. What is going on, Stabby? Dallas, give Stabby a little scratch on the head for me. Tell him it's from Joey. There's Gradius. Looks like um, space flight shooting game or something. Shared from Idaho. What's going on, Christopher? Good to see you. There's Karnov. I always wanted to look at this. Uh, Dustin, I like that joke. There's some sort of T-Rex looking creature. And this man with a giant mustache, a pterodactyl in the sky, like the monkeys from, I don't know. There's, there's a lot to take in there. Yo, what's going on? John doing great today. Thank you. Love to see people keeping retro games alive. Austin, what's all about here? Um, Donkey Kong Country 3, third one in the series here. The Flux Capacitor. Yeah, that might be what that was in that NES. I like that. Super Bowl, the Tecmo version. Tecmo Super Bowl. I remember it was the original Tecmo Bowl. I played so much. I wasn't really into sports games. It was weird. I'd never have been. But Tecmo Bowl, mm, loved it. Um, what's a weird game we've got in the store, Francisco? Um, I just did a video on one. I can't remember the exact title, but it was called like Paula Green's Equestrian Challenge or something like that. Some sort of horse riding game where this pro level um, rider kind of gives you tips and tricks through it. Kind of interesting. There's Castlevania. And ice hockey. And Bionic Commando, nice find here. Austin, can't wait for your order, that's so exciting. I love when I've got an order out there and I'm just waiting for a delivery. Samir, today you received your order? That's awesome, I love to hear it. Uh, there's Metal Gear, I can't believe Metal Gear was back on the NES. I just can barely get over that. Another Joey from Colorado, thanks for making it today. You can never have too many Joeys in here. I want a minimum of at least three, four Joeys every stream. Um, there's Life Force. This is interesting. Some sort of snake looking man. And, oh, wait, oh, one more thing in this collection. It's another NES console. This one appears to be screwed together properly, but the lid wasn't. <laughs> so it looks like these little tabs right here. One off this edge, and supposed to be one off this edge, and I think I can see the little piece of broken plastic back there. It would sit in like this. Luckily, we have replacements, something we should be able to fix. Okay, interesting first collection, but we're not done yet today. Does it count if my son's name is Joey? Of course it does. Of course it does. Another collection right here, coming to us all the way from Columbus, Ohio. It's basically a neighbor. We're in Pennsylvania. First one out of this box, it's Ultimate Alliance. From Scotland. Oh, thanks for making it. What time is it in Scotland? Soul Calibur 4. And there's Mortal Kombat. 
play as Kratos from God of War? Hmm. What's going on, Sir Charles? I'm glad you made it today. Elder Scrolls Oblivion. Just did a shipping video on a uh, Elder Scrolls game. Steelbox version of it. That was a neat one. Tony from Antarctica. That's wild. There's Lego Star Wars Complete Saga. Um, Terry, uh, question, original PlayStation or PS2? Which is better? Oh, tough call. Um, PS2 just has such a big library to it. There's tons of stuff I love on the original. Um, Ro Road Rash and uh, was Twisted Metal on the original. Uh, there were a bunch, but uh, PS2's just got an amazing library of games. I would say PS2 by a tiny bit. GTA 4. And Virtua Fighter. You know when they're up to number five on something. They've been doing it right. There's San Andreas. We got both of them here. There was Vice City in the other collection and San Andreas. Yo, what's going on, CJ? Another order came in. Oh, it's awesome. I love it. NHL face-off. X-Men Legends. In just a couple moments here, I'm going to be asking you guys if you've seen anything that's caught your eye that would make for a neat giveaway. So, get your thoughts together. I'm going to be asking in just a couple moments. You could play as Vader and Yoda. Yo, that's wild, Brady. I think I remember seeing gameplay of that. That's so cool. Star Wars Starfighter. What is this one? We all know all the other Star Wars games. Battlefront and... Yo, look at this Starfighter. That looks cool. Working on a PS3 collection, Alex. I'm not too surprised. That sounds exciting. I know you've been big into Sega stuff. ESPN. Oh, wow. Bully. Look at that. Always oh, thought this was cool. It's got this, like, embossed lettering and the symbol here. Um, Terry, what's going on? Ice Hockey or Blades of Steel? Which is better? Those might have been some of the NES games. Honestly, Terry, I'll be honest, I, I don't know. Um, Blades of Steel or Ice Hockey? I don't know. Maybe some of the comments can share, can weigh in. There's So Calibur 3. Need for Speed Underground. Oh, Turok. I love Turok on the 64. I'd love to try a newer version. Yeah, Twisted Metal Black, Martin. That's another good one. That's um, PS2, if I recall. And The Sims. Sims was just a huge thing. It just took over for a while. Everybody I knew was playing Sims. Kill Zone. Resident Evil 4. See that in here as well. And test drive. So we got one more in here, and it's another in the Virtual Fighter series. Okay, I think we should do a giveaway today. This second collection was a bunch of PS2 stuff. Uh, Bully, there was some P a little PS3 in here as well. So what do you guys think would make for a neat giveaway? Star Wars. Need for Speed. Man, this Turok game. Uh, there was some NES stuff out of today's first collection. So somebody else saying Bully. Grab that as well. I'm going to give you guys a few um, choices today. What about over here on the NES? Anything catching your eye? Super Nintendo game? Castlevania? Mm. Tecmo Super Bowl? Yep. Yeah. There's Tecmo Super Bowl. And I'm going to throw in one more, and that was Kill Zone. I think I'm going to have five choices for you guys here. Okay, for today's giveaway, this 
are what are up for grabs. It's either going to be, it's going to be one of these things right here. We've got four on the PS2. Resident Evil 4, Bully, Killzone, <clears throat> excuse me, and Turok. And then on the NES, we're looking at Tecmo Super Bowl. Okay, why don't you guys type in the chat which one you'd want to see me give away. Resident Evil, Bully, Killzone, Turok, and Tecmo Super Bowl. I'll give you guys a few seconds. Let me know what you like. Turok, Turok or Bully, Resident Evil 4. Killzone, Bully, Tecmo, Resident Evil 4. Hmm. Give it a few more seconds, see if we can come to a consensus. Turok, Bully, Super Bowl. Resident Evil, Turok, Bully. <laughs> Bully, I see getting a lot of votes here. Bully, Bully, Resident Evil 4, Kill Zone. Ah! Turok, Bully, Tecmo. All right, let's do Bully. Today, today's giveaway is going to be this copy of Bully. Just came out of a collection before it even got to the shelves, before somebody else could grab it. We're going to be giving it away, all for tuning in to the live stream. Okay. Here's how we're doing it. Got a list here with six names picked at random from those who shared today's post. One of these people will be today's winner. Our contestants include Sean Morita, Dusty Earl Vinson, Zach Fawcett, Kevin Morales, Jared Smith, and Terry Noble. Got six names, got a wheel here with six spots on it. Giving it a spin and seeing who today's winner is. Once again, we're playing for Bully. Oh, it's settling there on four. It's looking like to me. Kevin Morales. Kevin, congratulations. You are today's winner. You just scored a copy of Bully. Okay. Congratulations, Kevin. Reach out to us on a Facebook message and uh, give us shipping address, email address, all that good stuff so we can get the game shipped off to you. All right. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in. Two big collections today we opened up. Everything we show off is going up to our website at dkoldies.com. Be back tomorrow with new videos. Take care, everybody.